EKU basketball taking the floor at McBray Arena last night after spending their last two games on the road. Eastern Kentucky looking to get back in the win column against the Eagles of Asbury University. This is just the second meeting between these two teams. The last time they met was back in 2006 with EKU winning 63-46. And in the first part of the opening stanza, the Colonels came out hot. Nick Mayo working down low, turns around, fades away, hits the jumper to cap an 8-2 run. Freshman Dedrick Boyd feeds Mayo at the top of the key, and the main attraction shows off his range, putting Eastern up 6. Home team up 9, senior Dylan Avar finds freshman Peyton Broughton, and he hits the trifecta to extend the lead. Broughton looking to make it a 14-point game. He's off the mark, but DeAndre Dishman is there for the offensive board and the putback to put EKU up a baker's dozen. Boyd with the long pass to freshman A.J. Youngman, and he buries the long ball from the wing to put the lid on a 12-5 run. From there, Asbury would spread their wings and go on a 19-4 run to trim the Colonel lead to one. EKU would live from the stripe for the rest of the half and go into the break up 39-33. Coach McHale's squad would come out of the locker room and own the second half. Dishman would get things started with this easy lay-in. Next Eastern possession, Boyd gets out his camera so Dish can pose for his poster and put his team up a touchdown. Here he comes up with another offensive rebound and finishes strong. The sophomore logs 15 points and 9 rebounds. Dedrick Boyd was dropping dimes like he had a hole in his pocket, and Mayo picks one up from the corner. The junior jumped to number 22 on the all-time scoring list with 19 points. Boyd asks Broughton how he likes his wings, and he says in buckets... Eagles trying to chip away, but Boyd comes up with the steal. He'll move it ahead to Broughton, and the freshman goes hard to the rack. The London, Kentucky native pours in a career-high 21 points. Boyd on the dribble decides to keep his change in his pocket and take it to the bank. The freshman notches his first career double-double, tallying 17 points and 12 assists as Eastern Kentucky cruises to a 99-71 victory. The Colonels shot just south of 45% from the floor and were clutch from the free throw line going 24-27. EKU was back on the hardwood on Wednesday when they traveled to Bowling Green to face Western Kentucky. I'm David Miller for EKU Sports.